Welcome to Electro Online. In this video, we're going to explore what we mean by an equipotential line. Of course, the word itself kind of gives it away. Potential means voltage, and equi means equal, unchanging. So in other words, a line along which the voltage doesn't change. But there's a little bit more to it than that, so let's try to explore it. Let's say we have a two-dimensional plane, which is the board right here, and we have a ring, a circular ring here, and notice that ring has charge Q deposited on it, and of course the charge will distribute itself equally so that it will be in static equilibrium, and the electric field will then emanate away from that ring. Again, this is in a two-dimensional field, the XY plane. Notice I've drawn these dashed lines right here, which are parallel to the surface of that ring. We have one that's closer, one that's farther away, and we could draw an infinite number of them, all of them parallel to one another. Also notice that the lines always cross the electric field lines, or I should say the equipotential lines, which that's what they are. Those dashed lines are the equipotential lines. And notice how they're always perpendicular to the electric field lines, no matter where you draw them. So this is a line in two-dimensional space where the potential is constant. That's basically the definition of the equipotential line. And there's two things we should take note of. First of all, the equipotential lines always intersect electric field lines perpendicular to the direction of the electric field. That's really important. So no matter how the electric field is drawn, whatever line you draw perpendicular to the field lines will always be an equipotential line, meaning the voltage doesn't change along the line which is what the second point says, the voltage or the potential, whichever way you want to call it, remains constant when traveling along the equipotential lines. So as long as you stay along the line, the voltage will never change. Whatever the voltage is, it will remain constant anywhere along that line. So that's what we mean by equipotential lines. And if you keep those two things in, in mind, then it's pretty easy to deal with it. That's how it's done. 